Hello everybody, it is Animation Tutorials here, and today we are going with the second tutorial video of Pivot Animator. So today we're going to be covering three things, and they are, number one, the options on how to change your screens and onion skins, second thing is edit mode, and the third thing is droids. So, what I'm going to be talking to you about first is the edit mode. Now, I actually can't access this, can I? Oh, I can. My recording thing's in the way. This is going to make it very hard. <laughs> well, that's, um, interesting. Whatever. But now we're on here. It is in edit and options. Um, and then here it is. So basically, what I'm going to, what I'm going to be talking to you about is here with the width and the height, uh, what you should do. Uh, with it so it depends what sort of animation you're wanting to make but when you're wanting to make a very simple animation or maybe just this simple this guy just doing a very simple run just one guy running you're not going to want this massive ar arena of white space around this one person you want the main focus to be the person so, what I would recommend is looking at how big your stick man is, so for example this guy here, and say I wanted to make this guy at 200, and then I can see, oh, there you go, maybe I can make the width a bit, um, smaller. So maybe I could just go and make the width a bit smaller. You could either do that, or you can enter it in, so I might do... 500 by 500 and then there you go now our main focus is definitely the stick man which is really helpful because that's what you need when you're going to be doing something like this so now i'm not going to use this character but if i were to go up into here load a figure and get this no <laughs> i have so many people in here this basic stick and then I were to make him 200 and then I wanted to make this guy run then I can definitely see though the main focus is this stick man and that's what you want if you've decided no, this is still a bit too small, you can make him bigger. Or, you could just change the size. But that's kind of what it is. Um, that That's basically what that is. So, now what I'm going to be talking to you about is onion skins. So, I think the best way to do this is to hop into another animation. So, let's get into one. Okay, so what we have here is a animation that I've made called parkour galore and it's basically about the stick man doing a tiny bit of parkour it's really bad I'm not gonna lie it is really bad but I, I nonetheless I still have done this animation and for you know video sakes and purposes I'm gonna use this so I think what we're gonna do is you can see the frames are whizzing along at the top but I'm gonna I'm gonna go down here and back up a bit so first of all we have this white space uh, and then we're gonna go to like the, this frame now can you see this gray bit behind the stick man that's an onion skin and what an onion skin is for is to make you know it's there to make you see what the stick man was before so if I were to wanting to make the stick man move, I'd know how far he's moving, so I don't make it an, an exaggeration. For example, if I went into a new one, completely new, um, and then just make a stick man, I press this. If I'm going to have this guy go into this running pose like that. <laughs> That's a bit of a sudden move, isn't it? But, 
And then if I went like, actually, also if I went like this, and then like that, just drag it in any random place. It's not gonna look good. Look at this. <laughs> it looks like he's playing an air guitar. <laughs> it looks like he's doing an air guitar. <laughs> oh, that's actually pretty good. Oh, so good. But my point is that's not good uh you could go on to another animation um like this one no i would not like to say <laughs> i'm never gonna forget that but then you can see this guy's running and it's perfect it, it, it's not like that one we saw before it's no sudden movement and it looks really good obviously you can see doesn't look as good now but it still looks good <laughs> this is him sprinting I guess which is really cool um and I like that um and it, it basically the idea is it's not really um <laughs> I love playing around with this sorry it's not like the one we saw before because the other one has too much of a sudden movement this as you can see if i stop it is like this and it makes sense and that's the idea so what we're going to do is now we're going to go into a new one and we're going to talk about um the going to talk about this stick man here well not really this stick man i'm going to get out something different um for example this let's get out of this archer it's just random it doesn't really matter but here we are we have this archer here here she is in all her archer gloriness um what if i don't like this what if i want to make it different basically what we have here is we have something called um edit mode which allows you to edit a stick so to do that all you have to do is you have to click on it or you can highlight and then you can click edit it will probably only get one yeah but yeah you can go to full screen mode if you want you don't have to you can do a lot of things with this but basically all you do is you can edit it so what i'm going to do what i'm going to be talking about is how you can edit it so i'm going to go on a new one because i don't want to change this archer in any way any way shape or form because i really like it how it is and uh i just yeah I i'm sure <laughs> so basically what you have to do is this is it you start with this tiny thing and it's a stick but you don't have to have this for example let me show you what you can do so you can add this for example which is basically you make a circle bam i think the only problem it, with this is the fact that that is massive um it's white in between i'm pretty sure you can change that but at the moment it doesn't look good does it so that's kind of the only downside let's just try and make this amazing bike okay it's gonna be amazing we're going to love it everyone's gonna be like oh my god jacob you're the best at making bikes so another thing you can do is you can go up here i'm gonna go up and make this really bad like isosceles triangle <laughs> and then we're just going to go up here here going to get this thing up 
up here and add loads of lines to make it not make sense at all um <laughs> and then we're gonna have our seat here and then we're going to have this handlebar going up here and there we are this is our bike so there you go but what you can also do is i didn't really mention a lot you can have a circle in between two things if you wanted to i'm not saying you would just saying you can depends what build you're really doing to be honest what you're making here you can add another stick just a really random stick it doesn't really have to mean anything you can just do that there you go and then here you can delete it I'm pretty sure or is it no it's not uh, it's kind of like a transparent static dynamic thing so yeah um but yeah the next one is here you can t change which will be the main handle I think I'll go with this one um, which is cool and then here you can add something in between so you know if you wanted to do that you can do loads you can make it millions of things um, and then this is just quite simple you know delete Um, bye. So that's kind of what you can do with it. And then up here, it's kind of the exact same as you've seen on your thing. You know, the exact same open, save, save as, add to animation here, undo, delete, help is some. I don't think help is actually here, but you know, <clears throat> whatever. So we're going to get out of here. And now we're going to be talking about something else. Where did I get this archer from? It is um, basically from a website that I use a lot, and it's called Droids. Now, Droids is this um, thing. Ignore what my I have up here. Um, but basically, if you want to get on on it, I'll explain a lot more. But first, to get on it, Droids org is all you have to type and yes it's dot org forward slash if you want and then you go onto the website now um here you have stuff up here um and there's just stuff down here <laughs> and um home is basically this um animations you can go in here and then you could go and go into year 2008 and Lonely Friday Nights is one of my favourites. You can just see what other people have made. For some reason it's not working. Oh, here we are. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, that looks like me. Lonely Friday nights. Well, not really lonely. Lonely for like 50 minutes, but whatever. <laughs> Here is sticks, and this is kind of. <clears throat> I'm dying today. This is basically where you I get my stuff. So. Here you can get different types of stickman, stick packs, vehicles, weapons, objects, something random, effects, and backgrounds. So here you have like the latest 50 accepted or top 50 all time or stuff. So, you know, I'll go in here and I'll open it up and I can see I have some stuff or not. But you can just have a look at it here. Um, yeah. Looks cool. 
So, I mean, you can go on Stickmen. Stickmen here, you... And you... I'm not going to go through it. I don't think I should because this is kind of up to you to go and, you know, explore because I'm not going to tell you what to get, what to not because they're all really good. Um... But you can see that if I go in and I've got this thing, it's there. And it is genuinely a really, really good thing. So, I recommend you go explore everything you can. Because it is genuinely really good. So, that's all I'm really going to say about it. And that's kind of it for today's episode. Now, I know I haven't actually been over anything to do with animation. But the thing is... The next episode is when the animation will start. I'm just going over what you do first. Um, and now, you know, go explore explore droids. You can go and do a lot of things. And you can do a lot. Um, I really like this one. Um, but that's all I'm saying, go explore it, and the next episode will be on how to do a basic animation, and it'll be kind of a tutorial, kind of not, because I don't really like doing word-for-word, step-by-step tutorials, because I want you to explore it yourself, and do things yourself, and do things that you want to do, don't do things that I'm saying, maybe you could do something that I'm saying, but tweak it up a bit, so if I said make a fight with this sword and a shield, one guy has a shield, one has a sword. Maybe you could have a machete and a gun. I don't know. Just do whatever you can. Because you can get these from droids really easily. There are loads there. Or maybe you wanted to start with a vehicle going in. Um, you can get a lot. And then you can go here. You can just preview it first. Um, and you can see, oh yeah, I like that. Download it. And you can use it, and this will help you a lot. Um, When I found out about this, I was like, oh my god, yes! But I will see you next video on either Wednesday or Saturday. It depends if you want me to. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do one on Wednesday or one on Friday. Uh, That is it. I've been Animation Tutorials. I hope you enjoyed, and me and Mr. Walking Stickman will see you later. Oh. Looks like he's in a rush. Better um, go now. So, bye!